Hi, my name is Terry Pancook. I'm a practicing endodontist in Santa Barbara, California, and I'm going to show an interesting case of extra canal invasive resorption. I had this patient, a 65 year old male, who presented today with, uh, for the only reason was that this radiolucency, very faint radiolucency, was observed by a periodontist on the distal of this maxillary second molar. His only remarkable clinical signs um, consisted of a periodontal pocket measuring six millimeters on the mid distal, bled slightly upon probing. This bite wing radiograph shows a lesion with a little bit more clarity and how it approaches the pulp chamber. I'd like to pose a question. Is this information we have, the preliminary imaging, good enough? With the availability of cone beam CT technology, we can map this lesion very precisely and assess the prognosis, then develop a treatment plan and discuss the options with intelligence with the patient. Let's take a look at the power of this 3D cone beam CT imaging. As you look at this 3D image, you can rotate the tooth around and see very clearly that this is a limited crater at the distopalatal aspect of this root. Now, dynamically slicing through the transverse sections shows us the peripheral extent of this lesion and a very good clue where the osteoclasts are actually entering and breaking through the root surface. Note this still capture from the CT where there seems to be this little tunnel opening. This entry point is very small and unlike caries uh, it doesn't represent a very wide mushy area so that is one of the distinguishing diagnostic characteristics between caries and resorption. Now although I really like to look at this resorption defect in the transverse plane these other views, uh, the frontal view and we'll see the sagittal view sections dynamically sliced offer some additional information through these different planes of perspectives. On June 8th, the Schilder Institute is going to have a resorption symposium. Danny Bellamy will be moderator, Rob Kaufman, Rodrigo Cunha, Michael Pascal, Linda Levin, and myself will be presenting. You can register now at www.schilderinstitute.com. See you there.